Mike Kelly, good evening. Of course, fresh water freezes at 32 degrees, seawater at 28.4. We've been below both. New Bedford's port, a vital economic engine, needs a serious thaw. We've never had more than just a little bit of ice on, on the top. City officials say they've received reports of ice roughly six inches thick in some spots. One fisherman told me it took his crew two hours to go about a quarter mile the other day. We're working on dredging in the northern part of the harbor, and we heard something similar, like an hour to go 400 yards. Here's Coast Guard video of the Catherine Walker doing her part. They were able to bring a 175-foot cutter to do some ice breaking. They arrived yesterday, um, and then all morning they were in the main federal channel. New Bedford Fire and private tugs are also working around the clock in the harbor and in between the five city piers. Right now, it's all about preserving fishing days in a winter that has not shown much mercy. Scallop season starts on March 1st. If an icebreaker can, can uh, help alleviate some of that pressure, then that's what we're here for. And officials expect the ice breaking to continue through Friday, at least. Live in New Bedford tonight with the Southeastern Massachusetts Mobile Newsroom, I'm Jared Pletter, Eyewitness News.